19-year-old Ethan Sanchez lost his father James last year. Unarmed, James was shot in the back during an attempted robbery. The shooting shocked his community. Only police carried guns in this Western Pacific Island, and gun crimes are rare here. I mean, the island life is basically just a spear gun, you know, fishing. Maybe that's the only kind of gun they need. They don't need no firearm. 60,000 people live in Saipan, which is part of a U.S. Commonwealth more than 9,000 kilometers from the mainland. Residents say they'd always felt safe, and there was never a gun culture here. There are fewer than 200 police officers who have mostly had to deal with traffic violations and domestic disturbances. Saipan is self-governing, and there's long been a ban on handguns. But the island is also subject to many U.S. federal laws and constitutional rights. The decades-old gun ban was repealed by a federal court earlier this year after a Navy veteran from the U.S. mainland sued the local government for failing to uphold the rights of citizens to bear arms. Officials here fear that the ruling could change the face of criminality on this otherwise quiet island. In an attempt to deter ownership, the local government imposed a tax of $1,000 on every handgun that's brought in. The gun can then only be claimed from the police after the prospective owner takes a safety class and pays registration fees. Police say they're glad that despite the lifting of the ban, only a handful of people have signed up for licenses. It's kind of hard because I fought under the U.S. flag serving the military, U.S. military, but on the same token, uh, I have kids, I have family here. You know, and the less uh, weapons that is present to do harm, the more comfortable I'll be and as a parent. Professionally, I have to respect what's in the law. Another mainland U.S. citizen is now challenging the gun tax, and police are preparing for the worst. As Saipan's economy grows and more people come in, security officials say they have to be realistic and expect a rise in crime to come with development. Island life is changing, whether they like it or not. Marga Ortigas, Al Jazeera, Saipan, U.S. Commonwealth of the Northern Mariana Islands.